Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap for Tuesday, May 18th. Uh, small green day today, plus $261. Could have been much better. Had some technical difficulties this morning uh, with, with my charting data. And so I uh, missed out on a ton of good stuff that I most likely would have been in. So instead of throwing my computer across the room, I took a deep breath a few deep breaths and got back on track, turned it into a green day. So can't complain, plus 261. Let's go over these, I'll show you what we did. NVIDIA uh, on the mighty 90s, NVIDIA plus 100, Roku minus 260. That was actually one that uh, was a mistake due to my data feed, and so I ended up just closing it out right away, took a loss. And Tesla plus 350, no pairs trades today. And then Apple plus 156, Baba plus 80, Disney minus 350. Facebook 185. All right, so let's take a look at these and I'll show you what we did. Let's start with the Mighty 90s and NVIDIA. So NVIDIA, uh, so NVIDIA had this uh, push up, broke through the highs of the day with some volume here. Uh, so I got short right there, caught this little down move, got out of half my position uh, for over 10% profit on that move. And then this thing just started pushing up, pushing up, pushing up. And so I ended up just holding, I was considering adding, had some opportunities to add, but I didn't, just held. And uh, this thing finally rolled over when I got down to a couple red bars here, just cut out of it and took a profit of $100. Uh, next Mighty 90 was in Roku. So I, this is a, I put this as a Mighty 90 because that's what I entered it as. Unfortunately, uh, my charting was not working, and so I was getting the wrong data feed, and so my volume was all messed up. And so uh, had, the, had the data been correct, I would never even have gotten this trade. So I just uh, I got short like right in here. And then um, while I was trying to figure out what was going on with my charts, the thing pushed up. And when I realized what happened, I uh, just ended up getting out of it. So I took a $260 loss on that one. And then Tesla... Caught a nice little mighty 90 for 350 in Tesla on this on this push here, got short and then I added to it uh, right up here at the uh, at yesterday's high, kind of chopped around to the downside a little bit, got out of my last piece right down here at the bottom of this little pullback. So nice little trade for plus 350. Uh, on the runners, Apple. This is a trade that I just got out of like two minutes ago. So uh, this thing had. Yeah, tried to stay positive and then pushed, or it was positive most of the day, and then uh, started consolidating under this pivot. So right here, it tried to make a push above that consolidation and then broke down. I got short right here looking for a continuation, kind of chopped around for a while, then finally broke down. And I, uh, I was just kind of done watching the screens at this point. So just cut out and took a, took a profit of 156 on that one. Uh, Baba plus 80. This was one that was also involved in my data mishap. Um, so I ended up took in a, taking an upside runner here um, when it, it pushed up and then pulled back here. Kind of chopped around for a little bit, ended up pushing up. And then uh, when I got my real data and realized I probably wouldn't have gotten in that had, uh, had I had the right data feed, uh, I just cut out and just took an $80 profit out of that one. Disney minus 350. So Disney was a little bit of a bear. Um, Disney had this really strong move up early in the day and then came all the way back down to lows of the day. When it bounced up to the unchanged, I got short looking for a potential continuation. And that didn't happen. It just kept going, 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 going. And so um, I ended up adding to it, I believe, right here. And it finally rolled over and I just kind of scaled out as it went down and I got out of my last piece here, but still took a loss on that one um, based on where I, where I started getting in and, uh, and where I scaled out. So got back a bunch, but uh, still took a loss on that one. And then Facebook plus 185. So in Facebook, I uh, had this initial weakness and it was staying weaker than a lot of stocks. It jumped up to this pivot and I got short right here looking for a potential rollover. Uh, just kind of chopped around, chopped around. Finally, made a big push up and then dropped like a rock and then finally started to come down and ended up scaling out of it and getting out of my last piece somewhere down in here uh, for plus 185. So plus, uh, let's see, what was that? What was the total there? Plus 261, I think I said. Yeah, plus 261 on the day, which marks my 10th green day in a row. So 
uh, still continuing to keep that streak alive and hopefully build on it tomorrow. We'll be streaming every day the rest of this week, and then we'll be offline uh, next week. So look forward to seeing you in the live stream room tomorrow. Take care. Have a good rest of your day. We'll see you then.